Welcome back to Raw Sports Talk. I'm Chris, your favorite stat reader, and we have the Seahawks hosting the Rams, and the Rams are one and a half point road favorites. The over unders at 48. The Rams are minus 120 on the money line, and the Seahawks are plus 100. Now these are the overnight, uh, the pre kickoff lines. They're going to change the closer we get to kickoff on Sunday. It is supposed to be 52 degrees and 56 percent chance of rain, so it's going to rain for this game, and three mile an hour winds from the southwest head to head the rams are on a two game winning streak they are seven and three against the seahawks in their last 10 home team is six and four favorite is five and five against the spread favorite is eight and two on the money line but the underdog has covered the last four games that they've played against each other the unders hit in their last three the under is eight and two and the under 48 and a half points is eight and two this is their first meeting between each other this year the Rams took both games last year, 30-13 in Seattle, 17-16 in L.A. The Rams are on a two-game winning streak. There was a total of 42, 43, 35, and 50 points in their last four games. 18 points in a loss, 19 points in a loss, 20 points in a win, and then 30 points in a win. But when you get Puka and Cooper Cup back, a huge part of your offense comes back. You know, you have two 1,200-plus yard receivers that it's going to make any defense have to respect one, if not both of them. And the Seahawks have just crumbled. They're one and four in their last five. 49 points, uh, 60 points, 48 points, 41 points. 20 points in a loss, 24 points in a loss, 34 points in a win, 10 points in a loss. And it seems like the Seahawks have been doing this a lot over the couple of years, or at least... To me, it just seems like that. They get off to a start where they're like, wow, this team looks really good. Then they hit a rough patch and they look like shit. And then they go back and they start struggling to try to make a wild card spot. I'm going to take the Rams with the money line. I will take the Rams laying the points that I'm going under. These are just my picks. If you disagree, please go with your gut and please bet responsibly.